Hey everyone, welcome to Jacob Thompson 30, aka um, Dino Boy Gaming and Reviews. And here we have Transformers 86 Brawn. I don't know why, but every time I try to say his name, I always call him Brawl. When G there's no G1 Brawl that exists, at least from my knowledge. But anyway. This is a new figure I have never touched in my life. I'm going to wait and see for the next one that I will be making tomorrow. I was questioning myself on whether I make this video tonight or save it for tomorrow. I'm going to make this video now so I can focus on my actual other schedule I have, which is Making retro, uh, making retro reviews. La la, retro re, eh, retro reviews. If I can speak, sorry, my big old goblin hands are in the way. Uh. Dang, I did cut that. I couldn't cut that for a minute. But anyway. And yes. And yes. Whoa. He's got a... A... Whoa. I actually like this figure now. Hey, hey ho. And... Oh my gosh. Really? Really, Hasbro? Really? You you posed the feet down in the box? I mean, I get it. Slide them in there, but... That's funny. Okay, let me get his gun out. His... And then get him out. Now, this is my first figure that... Ugh. That always made me nervous with this thing. Well, not with this thing, but with other figures like him. Ugh. Come on. Get out of there. Yeah, there we go. Whoa. Okay, is his... Okay, I'm trying to make sure he's together. Ugh. Wait, what? Okay, there we go. That was really weird. Okay, there we go. I think I got it. His feet are really loose on his on this figure. I got no idea why. Yeah, his chest cavity, uh, his like upper half wants to come undone super easily. It appears. Ugh. But anyway, here we have brawl. Let me just fuck that over there. Oh, sorry. I did not mean to say that. Or maybe I, ouch. Or maybe I did. I say that because, uh, yeah, apparently the known lore about this character is that he actually got it on with that, with a human. Yeah, this giant metal robot banged a oh, this giant metal robot, this giant Autobot, banged a woman. I know, weird, right? Never thought I'd see the day. Well, yeah, it actually happened in the show. At least it was mentioned, I think. He was, like, trying to figure... Like, Braun was trying to figure out a way to have sex with a woman... Yeah, really, he was. Now, I'm saying that in this video because, well, uh, it, because this character is super weird. 
First of all, this character wanted to be human. Uh, or that, or maybe that was Hound. I'm not sure. But I do know that this character in the comics banged with... Basically had an affair with a human. And I think had a human child. Yeah, that actually happened. I know. A seven foot tall giant robot that could turn into a jeep truck thing. Yeah, that's literally ten times the weight of a normal human woman had an affair with it. With with a woman. It, it this this character did. It's so weird. I don't get it. But anyway. The, the back story about him. Because, you know, ugh. I don't want to talk about this on my channel. Talk about that on my channel. Because it's weird. Okay, his arms are on a ball joint, so they can go all the way around. It can go about... It can go up about that far. Can't go up any higher than that. Uh, there's a bend... A double bend at the elbow. <clears throat> I think... I think there's a hinge here. Uh, yep, there's a, there and uh, there's a um, a hinge right there for vehicle mode. Now be careful. I noticed that it's sculpted in that way, where it's supposed to turn. Be and it's super tight on mine. If you get if you, any of you get this figure. <coughs> Sorry. <coughs> if any of you get this figure and you're having trouble pushing his fist in, don't do what I almost did. Don't push it this way. Because if you push it that way, it actually gets stuck. And when I turned it, I thought that the paint started to chip. So, be wary of that, too. Now, his arm can, you know, move down due to the transformation. But that's only due to the transformation. Same thing on the other side. It's a little looser here on the, on the elbow. On this side than this side, it's weird. Can it can go up? Second verse is literally the same as the first. Up about that far, out about that far. Elbow bend about that far, and that's that. His legs can extend about that far forward and that far back. I mean, it can. I mean, it can go even further if you like. If you take this and move it a bit, it can go even farther. I'm trying to keep this, like, you know, where you guys can see it. So, you can have it like that. Still, I don't get why this thing does not want to, you know, go back to the way it was. What is it doing? That's so weird. And yes, his tire does come off. This is my first Jeep Transformer I own. So, I do wonder if they're going to take... Not this mold, but... I wonder if we're going to get... A Studio Series Hound? Because I would love a Studio Series Hound. The G1 version. Not the Age of Extinction. Well... Age of Extinction and um and um yeah. By the way, his um things were coming undone, so I had to fix that. But anyway, second verse him is the first. Like like the other leg you can go back up about that far and back about that far as a knee bend. And has a very good pivot. And the toe and 
heel spur pivot, but I think that's more for transformation. Overall, I okay, he has somewhat of a waist swivel, somewhat, but due to the fact that due to his kibble, it kind of obstructs it, kind of a little bit. So let's kick start his transformation now. I did notice that his wheel can come off at the back. Now, I don't know what this is used for, unless it's used for something. Maybe it's used to hold his gun. Hmm. I don't know what this extra tire is used for. Maybe... Well, actually, maybe it is. I mean, it is used to hold his gun in, in a vehicle mode. So, I'm going to assume that's like built-in weapon storage. But anyway, let's kickstart his transformation. So, I, so what what you're going to do is I think you're going to have to take his chest, and pull it down, then take the arms and swing them down. Down first, I think. Dang. Okay, that clip is in there tight. How come the other one went so well down? Well, went so well down, went down so well. That was we That's weird. Okay. And once you have that, you're going to come to here. Now, now this is on a, now this is on a swivel, on a turn dial, so you're going to, but first you're going to take this upper piece, raise that up. And then you're going to, hmm, uh, let me see. And you're going to take here on each side. Sorry, I get, my hand got so close. You're going to grab the arms. You're going to extend them out as far as they can go. So a bit like this. Then, so you, then, so you can take the chat, the front of the, of the, um, the Jeep and spin it around. I'm going to remove this. And you're going to collapse the feet and back. I'm going to take this. You're going to take the, the legs here. Just like what I did for over here. You're going to take the legs. You're going to split them into two. You're going to split them apart. And then you're going to take here, or, yeah, all right. Then you're going to take, okay, that's the back, I think. Uh, I'm trying to figure this out, too, guys. I took his gun off, so it would make it easy, just, this, just a little bit easier to uh, get it in there. Okay, so now what you're gonna what you're gonna do is you're gonna take his arms. You're gonna try your best to tuck them under these chutes. Ugh. That way the windows line up. And then you're and I'm gonna and you turn these like this. Ugh. That's weird. Why is it not wanting to go down? That's scaring me. I don't want to break it, but there's a there's a I don't know if you can see that, but there's a little tiny tab in between his arms. Now, I'm going to... Okay, then you're going to take his arms and... 
Try your best to snap them into place. This for, now for this other hand. Ugh. See? That's what make that's what scares me. You hear, did you hear that snap? That's what scares me. You see how tight that is? It's because there's been too there's too much pain applied to it. Now now what you can do is uh is take the leg with and what you're going to do is take, take this side of the leg and you're going to tab it in just like that. Now see how that does it stick? Is it going to go in? It's supposed to do that. Okay, so second verse is just same as the first, you're gonna take this, you're gonna, you're gonna collapse it just like so, and you're gonna, and there are these two little tabs, they're gonna slot into those little holes on each of the wheels. Now do be mindful that you be, that you pay very close attention. Because you don't want to accidentally miss. <laughs> I should have done that last. There we go. Pfft, that snap scared the bejesus out of me. <laughs> I thought I broke it. On camera. Wouldn't be the first figure that I allegedly broke. Allegedly. Yeah. Ugh. Okay. <laughs> okay. Okay. Now you're what you're gonna do is you're gonna well tr what I'm gonna do is try to get this uh, now what you're gonna do. Okay, that's weird. Okay, there we go. Is ouch. I scraped my toe against the against the wall. Yeah. I have a wounded too. It hurts. Hmm. But what you're gonna do, you know all that I just said, <laughs> but my foot, what you're gonna do with this is, there the, there's these two tabs, there, there's this, there's this tab, the tabs are on either side of the base of the head, and there are two tab ports on the, on the, on the base of the wheels, and there's a, and there's a port on each side here that's gonna tab into those holes on either end.
Ugh. Now this side can be a bit of uh, annoying. Or as Alistair says, from Masman Hotel. Yes, I watched that show. An unreal, an unreal bitch. Sorry, my hands keep getting so close to the screen, guys. I'm really trying to get this wheel in there. But, okay, so, eh. Now, there's a tab, there are two tabs on either side of the things, and I can't pull that apart now. Ugh. Ugh. Okay, and then... Ugh, come on. Then, then the last bit. <laughs> yeah. Ugh. There we go. See? Sometimes it just doesn't want to... Yeah, that. It just doesn't want to tab in. I'm going to remove his. We'll just stick that back up there. But before I finish this vehicle, here's the gun. Pretty nice detail. Got some excellent detail for just a piece of molded black plastic. But. <sighs> okay. I have tried. And tried to get this um, uh, there we go see but every time I try to get that flush it wants to pop apart there we go I think I got it I don't know do is the thing it scares me but anyway if it'll stay together who knows just squeeze it to make sure it's all nice and tight and compact and here is braun in his vehicle mode and Nice, uh, nice grill detail on the front there. Nice over rims. Nice detail back. He rolls as rolling things should. Now, luckily this isn't pinned on. These tires are pegged on. Well, oh, shoot.
I'm trying to make sure it stays together. But, yeah. His, um... His, um... And there's also, uh, no kibble. Well, there is a bit. His head is poking out of it, but I don't care about that. Uh, oh. uh, and all about sticking it on the, on the front there. And... Yeah, that's about it. Pretty nice figure. Pretty nice. Got a lot of good details. Didn't, and also he's got a little bit of windshield wiper detail on the back there. And by the way, the back window, not painted. He's got a windshield wiper thing, though. A lot of... Nice detail. Only thing I wish is... I wish there was more... Weapon storage other than... Up here. On the top. But that's just a nitpick of my... That's just one of my nitpicks. And also you can use his... Um, his wheel like a... Like a turret. To shoot the Decepticons while you're in battle. While he's in battle. -de 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 -de. And also, having affairs with women. This Transformer having affairs with women, not me. <laughs> it's, this Transformer is just weird, man. Weird story, weird character. Do I love it, though? Not really, to be honest. It does have very good detail, but... Eh, it's kind of meh to me, but, but, that's my opinion. It could use more paint, like, it, like it could be painted more, have more bits of silver on it a little bit more, a little bit more blue on, on the back window here. Can give us more weapon storage other than this. I mean, you could just take the gun and stick it in there. Come on. That just looks weird. And. And, um. Yeah, that's, that's all for me. And that's all for me, and and I'll see you in tomorrow's video, where it'll be for the royalty. Yeah. But I will put a note that that I have a ton of figures to review for the remainder of this month. Just so you guys know. I have Armada Starscream to review. I have... <sighs> can't believe I'm saying this. Cyberverse Megatron to review. Blitzwing, Rodan, Skullcrawler, Galvatron, and some of my vinyls. And all my Godzillas. And all my big Godzilla boys. And it'll be on to the Studio Series stuff. Which this being the first of... Which being the first Studio Series I have properly done on the channel. Other than Studio Series 105. And 106. 
But that's it for me. I'll, I'll see you in the next video of mine. Peace.